All right. Continuing with the short game. Again, to be a great player, you got to be great with the short game. Okay, because it saves you. It saves your cars, saves you from a bad hole, and it gives you birdie opportunities once in a while. All right, reviewing. Remember last chapter, last segment. A lot about chipping and pitching around the green. Before, I mean, and then putting after that. So get good at both of those, okay? Now, I had a request from Madeline out in California. She's working hard. She's able to continue golfing and, and really practicing, and she sent me in some videos, and Madeline had a couple of issues that her backswing, right-hand dominant, was taking her way back up in here, way back up in here. See? So if this is my target line, right, and I wanted to show her on camera that parallel shoulder to elbow, if you have some elbow break for extra arc, extra power, that's fine. But this needs to be parallel, not back up in here, because you only get there by the right hand pulling you here. Okay? And if you go that far back inside, right, so let's say I'm right here, watch what that massive, and credit to you, massive shoulder turn does. And I know uh, Bill up in uh, Michigan, uh, lefty gets too far back inside. Uh, talk to Frank about that. Talk to a lot of guys about when they go here and pass that and go back inside. Look what it does to your head. I'll just kind of do a normal swing. See, it just, you got to really strain to keep your chin up, and then when you do that, what does it do to your spine angle? So see how your spine angle's here. So then on the way down, you reverse it, and you go here. So getting way back up in here, you got to eliminate that. You got to stay on plane, on plane, down and through, okay? So really work on that. Lower body was good. Uh, knees are relaxed and just rotating. They're not bending. So Madeline, keep working on that. And all you folks, keep sending in your videos, and I look forward to hearing from you and talking to you. So. Uh, this next segment, we're going to continue with the short game, but we're going to do longer pitch shots. You know, the 20, 25, the 30 to 40, and the 50 plus shots. You got to get good at those distances. And I'm going to show you distance control for that part of your wedge game. 